Hi guys, it's me. Um, haul video here. Um, it's been a long time since I've done a video. Um, I've been doing shopping and getting ready for Halloween and everything in the fall. Um, my daughter started, my daughter Lily started preschool, so um, that's had me pretty hectic. Excuse me. And um, my niece, I don't know if any of you remember um, earlier in some of my videos, I had to do some soccer balls for my niece. Um, her soccer team went to states, and I was making posters and all kinds of stuff for them. And um, actually, they asked me again this year to do their senior poster, um, like bio board for their senior game. And um, so I've been working on that with my sister and making 34 soccer balls. Um, and they're not big. They're only, I'll show you what they look like. They're not big at all. They're only, I think, three and a half inches is what I cut. But you got to do the shadow. You got to glue this on. You got to glue the blue color that goes in there. And then with glitter glue, write RL for their school, um, their school's Redland. Um, so it's been pretty time consuming for me. So I haven't had a chance to do a video. But I have a few things. I'm not sure if some of these things I've shown. Um, if I have shown them, I'm sorry. I apologize. Um, like a lot of my stuff got mixed up. Um, stuff that needed to put away and stuff that needed a video. So I'm not sure whether I showed it or not. So if I already showed it, I'm sorry. Um, trust me, there's new stuff here. I just don't know if all of it is completely new. But we'll get started. I got this really cool um, at Michael's Seven Gypsy stamp. Um, sorry for the glare. Um, it says memories. It's got the airmail. Um, it looks French-like. Um, and then that flourish with the, the square that you can stamp inside. I think it's really cute. Um, got these when they were 40% off. <clears throat> I got this cling stamp, Hero Arts cling stamp. It's background stamp of bats. Um, got this when it was 40% off too. Very cool. This is the only this is the only background stamp I own now. Um, I don't know. I haven't tried it yet. If I like it, I might end up getting more. But I really, really like the way it looks. I'm just not sure. I've never used one before to know. Um, next thing, I'm, I'm, I'm just going to go sporadically back and forth to whatever I grab. The next thing, um, here uh, where I live, we live near Lancaster County, which you all probably know that it's Amish country. Um, very famous for being Amish, Amish country. And um, we go there uh, to camp. Um, when I say I'm going camping for the weekend and going to the scrapbooking store, it's the one in Lancaster. And every year, all the scrapbooking stores in the area, you know, my local scrapbooking store, the one in Hershey, the one in Lancaster, well, there's like eight in Lancaster. And then there's two, um, like, retreat houses where you can do scraps and go on a retreat for the weekend or a week um, in scrapbook. They get together and they, they have this thing called the Buggies and Buds Shop Hop, and it's because it's Amish country. Um, most of the stores are based out of Lancaster. Um, there's 12 different stores. Um, what you do, you get this. This is your passport. You get this bag. You pay $15 for your passport, and you get this bag for free to do your shopping in. And then with your passport, they stamp your home store right there. And then... Um, with your passport, you go to each store, and you can see they have little squares where they stamp it. You go to each store and um, get your stamp, and um, each store gives you 20% off of your purchase, of whatever you buy, um, during these certain days, which is October 2nd to the 14th. Um, and what you do, they stamp your thing, and then they either have a make and take for you to do there, or they have a take and make, which you can take along and do at home. Um, so once you get them all stamped up, then you turn it in at the end and, or whenever you're done. And if you do all of the stores, you can get a chance of winning a gift certificate for $240. It's $20 from each store. Um, if you only do the, I think it's 10 locations, and then um, the two retreat houses, uh, you can get a $50 gift certificate from one of the retreat houses. 
And then um, the first one is if you visit eight participating places, then you can get a 25 gift certificate from your home store. Um, but that's really cool. I thought it was really neat. So I can't wait for October 2nd because that's when I'm going to do my shopping um, because October is way too busy for me. Um, I have a doctor's appointment for my neck to see whether or not, well, I know I'm getting another surgery. It's just I have to figure out when. Um, my doctor's usually on a, a year waiting list, but um, I'm kind of hoping and praying I don't have to wait a year because I'm in a lot of pain and the pain is just sometimes unbearable. Like right now I'm okay because I took my medicine and, you know, I feel okay. But, you know, I can't live on medicine all for the rest of my life. And um, I'm just hoping and praying that this last surgery will do it. I've had th um, three surgeries already on my neck. This will make the fourth. And um, I'm hoping this one, uh, unfortunately, it's going to make me very limited in my range of motion. I won't be able to drive anymore. I won't be able to basically do anything that, you know, makes your neck move back and forth. Like, I can slightly move my neck, but after this surgery, I will have no range of motion. My neck, will, I will literally have to turn my whole body to be able to look at something. If it's off to my side or, or behind me, I have to turn around. So... Sorry, enough rambling. Um, get back to my haul. So, um, my son turned 13 this week. So that was another busy thing. Well, it was actually last week. And um, he had a birthday party, a 13th birthday party. So I made all the invitations. And he plays hockey. Um, and the school that he goes to, well, the school that he plays hockey for is the high school. And um, his high school is, their colors are blue and yellow. So what I did, um, I went to the scrapbooking store and I picked up some hockey paper. And I'll show that to you now. I think I already showed this before that I had gotten this because I think I might already have this. It's a Karen Foster design and it's called Hockey is Life. Um, then I got this one. This one is Scrap and Sports. I got this. It's got a hockey puck. It says hockey on it. And then this part is the one I like. It just says hockey on it. And then I got this one. It's also by Sports. The scrap and sports, the big hockey puck, and on the other side, it's little or a hockey puck. I got two of a lot of them because, you know, I had to make a lot of invitations. And the um, funny thing is, is I never even used any of these. Um, and I'll explain that to you at the end. These are also by scrap and sports. There's the front. It's just polka dots. And then it's got all kinds of hockey phrases and words in black and white. Um, it's got this real cool hockey one. Let's see like that really cool hockey one love that one and then I got two of this one this one's pretty cool it's like a pinstripe you could use this on mail cards and like even a wedding or anniversary card and then the front is um I got two of them the front just says hockey everywhere and then it's got the big gold print hockey also got this one which you can see I cut up already um I thought that's how I was going to do his invitations but I completely changed my whole mind um this is, it says hockey on one side, and then on the back side, it's got little tiny hockey pucks and polka dots. Um, but I changed my mind. I ended up making, um, uh, I used the corrugated box um, uh, cards from Michaels, those new corrugated cards. I used them because I thought they looked a little manly. Then I took, and I have Sports Mania. I think that's the name of it. Sports Mania. Hold on. I think that's the name of it. Yeah, sports mania cr cricket cartridge um, that I was cutting up um, hockey players, and I did them in his team colors, and then I just um, I just took and made a banner with my you're invited um, tag, and then I just did the inside very simple in his team colors also. Um, you know, it just said you're welcome to Ian's 13th birthday party. Blah 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 blah. So um, if I find one that I made or a picture of one, I'll try to post it. Um, if not, I'll probably make another one because I want to scrapbook it. Um, this I also got at the scrapbooking store. I don't know if you can see that really well. But it is. it says Pittsburgh football, and it's perfect because it can either be Pittsburgh Steelers or Pittsburgh um, uh, University. Um, my son's going to go to Pitt. I'm pretty much going to say it's Pittsburgh Steelers because Pitt 
um, doesn't go by Pittsburgh. They pretty much just call it Pitt. So it would probably just say Pitt football. But um, I want to know if anybody knows, is this laser cut? Because the back of it, if you can tell, I don't know if you can tell, but, like, it has these, like, burn marks like it was laser cut. Is that cut with the silhouette or was this cut with a different machine maybe? I forgot to ask the guy at the scrapbooking store. And if I don't get an answer here on YouTube, I'll just call him or talk to him when I go for the blog hop or the shop hop. But um, if anybody knows, let me know because I'm kind of curious. I also picked up these little brads that are um, skates. They're, they, they look like hockey skates. There's like the thick blade and everything. So what I was going to do was paint them um, or color them or ink them up black because, you know, guys, hockey skates are black. But I ended up not using them, so I'll save them for um, later scrapbooking of his career in sports because he is a huge ho hockey person. Um, also got this bag because it, it was a fall bag of buttons. And I actually was going to do, he likes the Pittsburgh Penguins, so I was going to do the Penguins. Um, colors, which is black and gold, black and gold, black and yellow. Um, and I was going to use these buttons on it, but I decided, like I said, to go with his high school team color. So this bag of buttons was only $2. I was so amazed. I mean, they're like some nice buttons. And like I said, it's a nice mix that looks like fallish. So I was kind of excited to get that. Um, next thing I got, like I said, I think I might have shown these papers, but um, these are the papers I got at Tuesday morning, the TPC Studios, the Great Outdoors. I think I might have shown these, but I'll just do them again real quick. A dog one. Um, this one kind of looks like it's a Valentine's Day one, and then it's got little chickies on the other side. Um, I've got the Harlequin back. And then the front has a cupcake, which is perfect because I just did Ian, just, you know, celebrated Ian's birthday. I know I didn't show this one because I just got this. It was $1.99 at um, Tuesday morning. It's TPC Studios. It's the Rockets and Ray Guns Outer Space. Then on the back, it's got the cutest, like, um, polka dots. And they're Christmas colors, like the, the non-traditional Christmas colors. So I thought that would be good for Christmas, too. So I got that. Um, I think I might have shown these. Actually, I know I showed these, so I'll just briefly show them. That one and that one. I don't know what that. This is like uh, like ones that say "You're my sunshine," "You're my friend," "Soulmates," all kinds of stuff like that. Um, and I know I showed this one, which was the Mediterranean Summer a la Hamra, and the in the back side looks like that. Um, sorry about that. Um, and then I know I showed these, um, the white paper, the autumn leaves white stacks of paper that I got at Tuesday morning for $1.99. I got three of them, packs of 35, so I got those. Um, I'm so excited. I saw on somebody's video that they had gotten the Tiffany colored, um, Martha Stewart scoreboard, and I went to my Michaels and saw it there and had to get it, and it was like 40% off, so, you know, I was like, okay, I'll take it, because they don't usually put her stuff 40% off, they usually only do it like 25% off, so I think it came down to 14 something, I don't know, um, but um, my next goal is to get the mini one so that I can take it to my crafts with me. I got the Tiffany one because I'm going to use that for myself, and then I, I gave the old one to my daughter, Courtney. Um, so she has one. She doesn't have to bother with mine. Um, but uh, I really want the mini one, though, because it is so cute. And you can take it with you to crops, and it's perfect for card making. Um, okay, so the next thing I got was paper again. And I'm almost at 15 minutes, so I'm going to close it out here and start with another video. Um, so I hope to see you guys back in a little bit. Bye.